When you pick up pots from the thrift store or maybe you've just had some left over from a few years and you have no idea how big they are, then you need to measure them so that you can get the correct measurements in order to fill them properly to know how much soil you need so you won't overbuy if you're buying your soil. So there's different ways to measure different containers. We're going to start with this red pot right here. It's a square pot. If it's rectangular, you want to do the same thing. If you take a look, there's a little lip on the inside of your container. That's where you want to measure from, not the outside rim. So you just take your tape measure and you put it on the very inside and measure. This actually measures about four and a half lengthwise. If it's rectangular, you're going to need the width and the length of the pot. Also, you want to go on the inside to get your depth. Never measure your pot directly from the outside. This doesn't have legs, but you can see a little bitty indent here. This right here is going to give you a false reading because this is not the actual depth of your pot. You want to go inside and you want to go if you have anything raised in there as you can see there's a little reservoir in there I'm tilt it and bring it up again bring your tape measure up again just until this little rim not the very top because you're not going to fill your pot all the way up to the top so you need the depth starting from the inside edge down that's on a square or a rectangular pot now let's get to our round pots. Round pots, you wanna measure the depth of them the same way by doing it on the inside of the pot, not the exterior of the pot. You want to measure it this way, but you also, right here, as you can see, it's measuring nine inches. You want to take your tape measure and slowly go around the rim. And if you notice, the size is getting smaller. Here it is eight inches. So it's going to depend on where you measure it at. Sometimes the pot is just not absolutely circular. Right here it's eight and a half. About the same distance as it was over here at eight inches. So take your largest point and that's the point you want. Right now we're right at nine inches. So this would be a nine inch pot. Those same rules will apply for any pot, no matter what material the pot is. And if you're limited on space, always remember to take a tape measure along with you when you're thrifting, in thrift stores, or shopping, so that you can measure and make sure you have the right size container for your space. Please remember to subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell so you won't miss anything. I'm Pam, this is Zone 7B, and anywhere you can sit a pot, you can grow a plant.